Hello guys, this is King and welcome to Pinoy Tube. So for this video, i-update natin yung Redmi Note 9 sa MIUI 12. So, stay tuned guys. So, welcome back guys. So ngayon, bago natin simulan yung update ng Redmi Note 9, uh, magpapasalamat nga pala ako sa mga bagong subscriber ng Pinoy Tube and maraming maraming salamat sa pag-subscribe nyo sa amin at sa walang sawa nyo yung pagnanood. Yung mga simpleng pagnanood nyo lang, pag-subscribe, pag-like, pag-share, uh, malaking tulong na sa pamilya namin ngayong panahon ng COVID-19. So maraming maraming salamat sa inyong lahat. Yan. So simulan natin yung update. So kung Redmi Note 9 user kayo, uh, recently this week nagkaroon ng update yung Redmi Note 9. So, lumabas na update. Updates are available version 12.03. So, pupunta tayo sa settings. Ito makikita natin sa about phone natin is may nakalagay na update. Yan. So, checking. Lalabas is MIUI version 12.0.3. Yan. So, stable version daw to. Ito yung 500 MB na file. Yan. So, highlights. MIUI 12 Yours alone, yung motif nila So, ang madadagdag daw dito Is yung system animation All new physically based animation engine With advanced architecture Will refresh your device look Dynamic window technology Take switching screen orientation To a new level Animation in selected scenes Sumunod na update is yung System visual. So, brand new visual design works for all types of contents and languages. Magazine level layout. So, parang magazine na daw yung pinaka system visual niya. Floating windows. Pull down a notification sent by a messenger app to turn it into a floating window. So, pwede nating hilain. So, naka special. Parang naka bubble na yung ano natin. Floating yung mga messages natin you can minimize a floating window using a full screen gesture control center swipe down from the upper left corner to open notification shade and from the upper right corner Yan. so dark mode dark mode support is also provided for third party apps now so pag may dark mode dark mode na tayo so Pwede na natin i-dark mode yung mga ibang apps. Gaya ng Facebook siguro. Kasi hinahanap ko yung dark mode dito sa Facebook. Hindi ko pa siya magawa dito sa Redmi Note 9 na MIUI 11. Optimization, brightness and color improvements for wallpapers in dark mode. Tapos sa system daw, full screen gestures are now ignored on the lock screen. So hindi na pwedeng gamitin yung full screen gesture pag nakalak yung screen natin. Fix. Home screen went black and started flashing. Unlocking in some cases. So, wala namang ganun sakit yung amin. So, yun daw yung fix. Noise could heard when the screen was turned off in some cases. So, kahit nakasarado na yung screen natin minsan, lock, parang naririnig mo pa rin yung app na naandar sa likod. So, inayos na daw nila yon At may bagong Android security patch to July 2020. So, increased system security. So, July 2029 patch ng Android natin. Lock screen. Custom signature didn't appear on the lock screen. Status bar notification say shade. Screen lights up with the animation now. Status bar color gradient animation na daw. Home screen. App drawer allows you to keep your home screen neat and categorized. So weather. New animation. Bring the weather from outside directly to your screen. Security introduces new comprehensive privacy protection mechanism. Tapos yung darawang sunod, notes. You can create folder with notes now. New dynamic backgrounds look gorgeous. Tasks are completed with satisfying animation now. And lastly, yung security. New animations feel natural and refreshing. Binging your favorite shows will be more convenient with our new video toolbox. Yan. So, pag magda-download kayo guys, kailangan is medyo may charge naman yung battery nyo. Dapat at least 80% pataas para sigurado tayo na download ng maayos yung update. 
And napaka-importante rin, syempre, na dapat stable yung internet natin pag ida-download natin yung update niya. And so, and so, na-download na namin tong update na to. So, ang gagawin natin ngayon is i -re reboot na. Ngayon, pag ni-reboot nyo yung Redmi Note 9 nyo, guys, siguraduhin nyo na after naga-update siya, wag nyo siyang pakikialaman. wag nyo isya shutdown, wag nyo i-re-restart kasi, um, Pag hindi natuloy yung update nyo, mabubut loop na yung Redmi Note na inyo. And kailangan nyo nadalhin sa service center. Ayan. So, pipindutin na natin yung reboot now. Ayan. So, hindi natin ipapas forward yung pag-boot na ito. Kasi yung iba, uh, naiinip sila. So, ang nangyayari, habang nag update yung Redmi Note 9 nila, pinakikailaman nila, nire-restart nila. Kaya, ang nangyayari, nabuboot loop yung pinaka-OS nila. Kaya, dapat, nakalagay guys, huwag nyo pakikailaman, don't turn off. Huwag nyo i-reboot. Kaya importante na may charge yung unit nyo. Ngayon sa performance update niya, titignan natin kung uh, magiging mas smooth ba yung Redmi Note 9. Kasi usually, yung Redmi Note 9 namin, uh, asawa ko yung gumagamit nito. And uh, sa pagkakarinig ko, yung gamit kong Mi Max 2, yung napaka lumang-lumang unit ko na, hindi na yata i-update sa Mi UI 12. So, stuck na tayo sa Mi UI 11, mga, Red, mga Mi Max user. Ayan. So, halfway na tayo guys. 45% na yung update niya. So, medyo matagal talaga yan. Dapat pasensyoso lang kayo. Hindi nyo talaga pakikailaman. Ngayon sa mga nagtataka bakit yung mga ina-unbox namin is yung mga uh, iba't ibang mga gadgets. Hindi mga smartphone yan. So, sa Pinoy Tube kasi, iba't ibang mga ina-unbox natin dito. Hindi lang tayo puro smartphone. So, iba't ibang device. Uh, depende sa kung ano yung pangangailangan namin sa device na yun. So, halimbawa ngayon, Yung last na in-unbox namin is yung sealer kasi meron kaming bagong negosyo ng asawa ko yung sa Shopee namin. Nagbebenta na kami ngayon ng kimchi. So lahat ng ginamit namin ng mga device, mga binili namin, yun yung mga i-unbox ko guys. So stay tuned lang kayo. Meron tayong mga unboxing ng heat gun para sa pang seal ng product at yung uh, food processor na nabili namin. So mga mura lang naman yung mga gadgets na yun na mas mapapadali yung trabaho. Kaya yun yung mga binili namin device. And kung gusto nyo kami supportahan, meron kaming link dyan sa baba. Sa description box, hanapin nyo lang yung Taste Our Kimchi. Pwede nyo i-click yan para makapag-purchase na kayo ng binibenta namin kimchi. Yan. So maraming maraming salamat sa inyo guys. So, 52% na. So, intayin pa rin natin to. Uh, bibigyan ko na lang kayo ng magandang music dyan, background.
Ayan. So, natapos na. 17 minutes or 18 minutes bago natapos, guys. So, ngayon, uh, swipe up natin. Ayan. So, na-unlock ko na siya, guys. So, nakalagay uh, 12 yours alone. Meet the new Mi UI 12. So, next. Mi UI new features. So, new animations daw. Compromising your privacy. Control Center. O, ngayon, sa akin, sa update ko, yung new features nila, parang sira ulo. Hindi natin nakikita yung dinagdag na new features. So, casting. Home screen. So, new visual experience daw. Ayan. So, naiba na yung itsura ng MIUI 12. So, nakaayos na lahat. So, ginawa nila Google Productivity Tools and Social. Ayan. So, pag nakatapos yung update nyo, guys, makikita nyo sa what's new, nandun lahat yung mga binago nila sa system animation, system visual, floating windows, control center, dark, dark mode, system, lock screen, status bar, notifications, shade, Home screen, weather, and settings, note, security. Yan. So, bago na yung uh, design niya. So, kasi naka-dark mode kami, all. So, sana, pati sa Facebook, may dark mode na rin siya. Yan. So, bibigyan mo, gagamitin muna namin ng maayos itong uh, Redmi Note 9 na may Mi UI 12. Tapos, bibigyan ko kayo ng update or finalization kung ano yung improvement. Ba kung mas naging smooth ba yung mga... Uh, animation niya. Yan. So, successful yung update namin sa Redmi Note 9 Mi UI 12. So, if you like this video guys, don't forget to like it and subscribe for more Pinoy Tube videos. Thanks for watching. Bye!